Question 247. Is there something <laughs> you want... I can't actually say that word. A board? A board? A there... board. Is there something you once hated <laughs> that you now <laughs> adore? <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh. Um. When I was younger, I used to hate spicy food, and now I put fucking hot sauce and spice in absolutely everything. Mm. Okay, I like but spicy I... food, but yuck. <laughs> everything. <laughs> Well, uh, but most things I cook usually gets paprika and, and spices and things. It adds flavour and everything. Mm. I, I definitely, I'm definitely Perfect. find I'm eating a lot more spicy food nowadays. Although, a yeah. lot less than when I came off the uh, opiates. When I, came, I, I my food had got my spice use had gone way up to the point to the point where I was reacting to it. Um, and I, we came off it, oh, yeah. and all of a sudden, I can't, I can't take, I can't take half of what I used to be able to take. We have an Indian that does pizzas. Fuck me and them pizzas spicy. They, even their sauce is spicy. It's, it's... Spicy pizza is yummy. Oh my goodness. I like spicy pizza. Pineapple on pizza. No. Yes, no pizza. Never. Oh, <laughs> it's the worst thing. Tom says capitalism. Scummer says Guinness. Tom says supreme yeah. pizza. Oh, I don't mind a supreme as long as you leave the pineapple off it. <laughs> Russell Sprouts says, oh, and the olives. I'm oh. not a fan of olives either. <laughs> no, Paul, no. I, Brussels sprouts are forever hated. Yeah, they're just terrible. <laughs> yeah. I used to hate cabbage, but I quite like cabbage now. It's like eating a bullet of fart. <laughs> I've even tried frying them, you know, if you do the, the bacon uh, lurdons and you fry them up with that, then no, they're even, no. It's not you can do with Brussels sprouts. <laughs> No, Brussels sprouts are good if they're steamed and, you know, lots of butter. Nah, the, the butter's good. Yeah. Just, <laughs> just put so much butter on that you've got just butter. Yeah. Are, are, are you sure you're not just having butter with a slight flavouring in Brussels sprout there? Well, no, that that's like French fries. French fries are not a food. <laughs> they're simply a vehicle for salt and ketchup. In my case, it's a vehicle for salt and mayonnaise. <laughs> I'm go generally Polish, mate. Going you know. to say something controversial. Oh, shit. Cheese on toast. Again? Yes. Yes. You used to not like cheese on toast? I can't stand cheese, but not... I've started to like cheese on toast. How did... How? How? What? How do you not like cheese on toast? I don't like cheese. How do you not like cheese? I can't stand cheese. Cheese on toast is basically a pizza without sauce. That's just what I was going to say. You get all you get all fancy, you put a bit of pizza sauce on, um, you've got yourself a mini pizza. I used to do that when I was a kid. Yeah, I still you do it still now. still do that sometimes. No, if, you've got, different... if you've got slightly stale bread, you can make yourself some nice little yeah. mini pizzas. You can, yeah. yeah. I think the difference between cheese on toast and a pizza is that on pizza, the sauce goes under the cheese. Whereas on cheese on toast, any sauce you put on is supposed to go over the cheese. Yeah, but it doesn't happen. And also it's on toast. I think we can just agree the cheese is better than chocolate. As long as we can agree that. Oh, definitely. <laughs> I can, right there. I can get Quick answers. Ricardo says... Cheese and chocolate. Mm. Uh, no. I need, <laughs> no. I need chocolate medicinally. Why would you destroy chocolate? <laughs> Quite a nice combination of flavour, cheese and chocolate. Yeah, that's oh, if you like yeah. cheese. Okay, no, I, I'm, I'm going to say, together. I'm going to say that my answer to the original question is uh, the romance scenes in films. Hmm. I used to absolutely despise them, uh, but now I tolerate their presence. Hmm. You tolerate them. You meant I, to, you, you don't adore <laughs> them, which is the point here. Let, let, me, let me put this way: I like that they're there, but I, I still wish they were a lot shorter. There is some pop. That I once hated, that I quite like now, which I find quite worrying. I was reminded of it. <laughs> well, your, taste, uh, your tastes do change as you get older, though. They do, and I think the issue is, is it's songs that I hated at the time, but because they were played all around me, they kind of went in as a as a as a thing now. So they're now more nostalgic. So I like them. If that makes the, it and Dave's turned into a robot. <laughs> your taste buds don't change. It's the kids that are wrong. <laughs> right, quick answers from the chat again. Ricardo, socialism. Tom, anal. Uh, nerdy <laughs> pineapple Jaffa cakes on pizza. 
Not a great game. Uh, plugs of uh, plugs of all of the butt variety. Tom, fish, all fish. Turns out my mum just can't cook fish. Do you know what? I didn't like chicken. I was convinced I didn't like chicken. I was convinced I hated chicken as a kid. And when I got to 17, I went to KFC. I thought, <laughs> shit, I really like chicken. My mum can't cook chicken. Um, KFC's wrong, though. KFC smells the same coming out as it does. <laughs> That's not right. Actually, my, I, I was serious about taking chocolate medicinally. That uh, it actually is the most effective thing I found for suppressing the ticks from my Tourette's. That's really weird. Oh! Do you know what it is, in it? Well, um, they're not even quite sure what causes the Tourette's, but one of the leading theories is that it's an excessive number of dopamine receptors. Mm. And chocolate causes your brain to produce dopamine, so I think it clogs up the excess receptors. That, would that not also imply that that that, uh, that that sex might be a good cure, a good uh, way for managing symptoms as well? Yeah. Well, actually, yeah. I've always <laughs> had an incredibly high sex drive too. Very <laughs> <laughs> uh, back with it. Salt and ranch dressing from Tom again. Tom has a lot of things. Uh, lovely. Uh, Paul said, "Oh no, that's not a like. Can't read that." People criticizing the fact that I hate cheese. <laughs> Which is definitely a right. To okay, do. Trainback is saying I hate imbrew. What what is imbrew? I have no idea. Iron brew. Iron brew. Sorry. <laughs> I is had that to actually like read that. Iron, but with lots more alcohol. Iron brew. Iron brew lets you pick up sidewalks and sweep things under them. Made in Scotland from Gerdas. Yep. <laughs> okay, so is this like Scottish Red Bull? Yeah. Uh -oh. it's sort less of. sugar in it now. The people in Scotland went buck mad because they've changed it and all, but it's a very... It is a Scottish drink. Right. Uh, Tom said Lady Gaga. Maya says orgasms cure all ills. I'm in a difficult position in that regard because I find it rather difficult to orgasm if anyone else is there. <laughs> that could be quite interesting. Dan, you seem to have frozen. You're giving me this the most intense stare. Sorry? <laughs> no, it, it froze you for like 20 seconds and you adjusted yeah, really? into the camera and you were just there like... <laughs> He's hypnotized. Uh, what's my internet doing? <laughs> Everything. One of the things that sucks about this lockdown is I was actually, you know, talking to somebody, you know, through emails. And, you know, I moved here and then, of course, it was, you know, getting the place organized so I could live here. And then the lockdown started. Mm -hmm. And if it had gone like, you know, one more week before all this bullshit with the virus hit, I probably would have had my first date in five years. You could have hit the lockdown at exactly the right time. You could have been stuck there. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I, I am glad that we at least got the move done before the lockdown stuff started because we yeah. would have been stuck in Michigan. How much stuff is still there? Oh, that would be good. What do you mean? I thought I thought you'd have had to leave, you'd have to uh, store some stuff up there. Oh yeah, I did, and the real shit of it is. Among the stuff I decided I probably wouldn't be needing for a few months is a box of N95 masks and nitrile gloves. Oh, great. <laughs> so those are in storage in Michigan and I can't get to them. It's alright, they can't get to you either. <laughs> this is... <laughs> ah, that's bad. You're always looking for the bright, the, the, the silver well, lining. My, my sister works for a care center up there, so I told her where they are if she wanted to go and dig them out of my storage. <laughs> Mario popped up in the back room. Ooh. <laughs> gonna See, I reckon what you should do, Purple, is you should do uh, you should have dates online. Who's in the back room? Mario. Yeah, well, you know, yeah. date online Mary. doesn't really help with the sex drive problem. Well, it does for me. Do you want yeah. to rotate me, rotate me out for a bit so you can ask Mary the question? Sure. But that's that's due to my not orgasming around people business. 
<laughs> Hello. Hello. Perfect. Hello. 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 Right. Hello. Popping in to say hello. It's hello. You have to answer the current question now. It's question two hundred. Like? Go on. It's question. What's the current question? <laughs> two hundred forty-seven. Is there something you once hated that you now adore? Spinach. Spinach. I sure I quite <laughs> like spinach now. Sagaloo. Yeah, I, I actually really like spinach, and also um, uh, pumpkin. No, I hate, still hate pumpkin. It's still horrible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I still don't like spinach because spinach, uh, I once ate spinach just by itself and I literally threw up everywhere. Did you do it to try and get strength? No, I just, there was spinach and I ate it and I, 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 I then unate it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I like spinach leaves. Pizza. I'm not a big fan of like this baby spinach leaves, not like actual spinach spinach because that's still awful. It's still awful. <laughs> I, I like um, homeopathic spinach. <laughs> what lettuce? No, I like spinach where there's so little spinach in soup that they might as well not be spinach. Mm. 